Have you been beating yourself up? I had the realization this week that since I haven't had anyone beating me up on the mat for two months, I've started beating myself up. A very minor bump in the road with a client turned into a major crisis in confidence for me. I fell into the dreaded downward spiral. If you haven't heard episode seven on the downward spiral, listen to that next. Until this week, I was unaware how much better I had become at setting boundaries and clear expectations and going after what I wanted off the mat because I was physically doing it on the mat, or at least trying, a few times a week. It was becoming ingrained in me, and I carried that behavior and confidence off the mat out into the world with me. I didn't even know that I was beating myself up until a friend brought it to my attention. It hadn't occurred to me that the impact of not training would be mental as much as physical. I knew my gi was getting a little tighter, but I didn't think I was mentally losing my edge. If you find that you've started beating yourself up, stop it right now. Now I'm aware of what's going on in my head. And since I know better, I'm changing it. Today, I'm creating my game plan for how I'm going to move through next week. There will be conversations about boundaries and expectations. And I'll see some of you on Zoom for class. I'm Jen Eads, and I hope you take time to take care.